Recycling is an important part of day-to-day -day life at the Leratong Preschool in Soweto, South Africa. The children are taught how to use rubbish like paper, cardboard and plastic to make toys and furniture. At the school, the children's teacher, Lea Maboe, shows them how to make papier-mâché and encourages them to be creative. In our preschool, usually, we use all kinds of waste materials with the children. Now, we cut paper into pieces, we make it wet, put in some glue, and then we mix the dough. They do their making to develop their small muscle skills. In actual fact, the parents do like it very much because sometimes they bring us all kinds of boxes. And another thing that we are training them to, to communicate. It must be a, a teacher, parent and child communication. The children do bring all those material to us. Recycling is a cheap way of making use of your rubbish to create new things as the materials are free. But it also helps the environment. Making furniture and toys from waste paper reduces the amount of unwanted litter on the streets and means that fewer trees are chopped down. We are trying to show the children the usefulness of some of the materials. They can make toys, a lot of toys, out of the handy handy bottles. We made boats, scoops, and any other thing that is, you know, plastic-like that is washable, because we feel that it's hygienic for the children to play with because it can be washed over and over again. The children enjoy it very much. They enjoy it very much because they learn how to be creative. They learn creating things. The toy vegetables help to teach the children about the importance of a healthy diet, while the papier-mâché furniture is put to practical use throughout the school. Small tables, chairs and cabinets are built layer by layer and then painted in bright colors. The furniture is surprisingly strong. This cabinet is out of different sizes of cardboard boxes. We put the, the boxes together to make them strong. We make some vegetables. Make, this is a banana. We made a banana out of the paper mache. And we make some uh, crockery or any utensils that we can use for the children to play in the make-believe corner. We would like to, to help you know, develop our own skills, encourage the developing of our youngsters in doing things for themselves.